Greetings and salutations, my name is JW608, and today I am playing Star Maid, and I've still got the small ship shuffle going on. I'm in a tiny little ship that's totally irrelevant, because I have it on God mode, because I'm going to do some testing and I don't want to get shot to death this time. But here I have my little fighters. I have six uh, fighters, and I have two bombers, two U-bombers. These are the vessels that will be support craft for the my dreadnought I'm working on, the very boxy little units. I love them. Anyway, they are set in a fleet. Hopefully that's not going to be too irritating, the small ship shuffle. It is going to be incredibly irritating. All right. Anyway. Okay. Oh, that block off. I don't want that block. There we go. Well, let's see how they, uh, how they uh, work in combat. Uh, so let's tell the fleet to sentry mode, so we'll attack whatever's whatever uh, pops up this way. Let's spawn a ship, let's add one. Mm. How about we add... We'll start easy, we'll add it as sand. Wow, I need to clean up this, this stuff. A beam is sand. Let's start with one, negative one faction, so he's going to be a pirate. And instantly, he's overpower, or he's overpower. I see blocks flying off. He's 91%, 88% reactor. Uh, something got shot by him because there's debris coming that way. Who's the shot? Ah, huh. one shot. Blue four is unloaded. Uh, the blues are the. The fighters, green, are the uh, bombers. 55%. And I have no guns on this ship, so I can't help. Other than maybe distracting them by accident. E. Come on, guys, you got to get close, because you have missile beams. Beam missiles. No, missile beam, yeah. There you go. Uh, the bombers appear not to be firing bombs, which is all right, I guess. I say as a bomb streaks across the sky. Well, what's, what's shooting bombs? That's blue and blue. And oh, there's another bomber in range. Ah, oh, okay. Cool. No idea where you came from. All right, twenty-seven percent. What do you have to? Is it twenty-four? Twenty-five. He is now neutral and overheating. Okay, guys, good job. Order. Uh, order information. So let's get everybody back together again. Get the band back together. Except the interloper over there. Let's see what actually happened to this poor ice hand. Ice hand. Whatever. Wow. So ten of these guys just kind of chew up a uh, a single fighter. But I imagine this rear you is a uh, sentry mode. Oh, they're actually in formation this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, we didn't even lose any. Awesome. Oh, one's starting to spin. Ooh, you got shot up pretty good. Who are you? Your blue one? Blue one, are you still functional? Yeah, it looks like you could still kind of fly. Your computer, your weapon computer is good. Yeah, you're you're good for another day. Didn't look like the bombers took any damage, or the other fighters. Okay, let's try something a little more substantial. Uh, add uh, not a dreadnought because that would just obliterate them. 
Oh, an EB would destroy them without without thought. But I want to see. I want to see how how they will actually do against it. All right. So I have five functional five functional fighters and two functional bombers against an EB class battleship, the Emperor battle Emperor class battleship. Not an EB class, but just to see, will they even be able to hold their own? This thing has 4.5 million shields with an unbelievable amount of regen. It has some really big guns on the front. It has a turret that looks like does missile, missile, well, streamers, which is a missile cannon now. Swarmers, not streamers. And it's doing the confused spin and just shot me. Weapons I actually stuck on. It has a potent cannon. I don't think I've actually gone through and readjusted the weapons on this one. I really need to make the uh, engine more shapely. Anyway, well they're keeping it at right at 20% shield. So they aren't really letting it uh, aren't really letting it regen too much. Which is one of the things I want want with a uh, a ship like that. All right, test time. Let's grab green one. Let's actually hop into the. Oh, it did fire the missile. Now I'm still in God mode. So this isn't. Oh no 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 no! Windows, what have you done? Okay. I found some sort of weird hotkey that takes screenshots. Anyway, I'm in god mode, so I'm not going to take any damage. But I do want to see about... How hard it's actually going to be to aim a bomb. Because it has to fire for a few seconds before... And let's get in the bomb aiming room. Angle. It has to fly a few seconds before it's armed. And I'm a terrible pilot, and I really need to get away before it. Just slam on the brakes. Ooh. Did I run into my own bomb? I think I ran into my own bomb. So let's try that again. And because I'm in god mode, it didn't destroy my fighter. Thank goodness. Eee. I'm firing my laser. The idea for the bombers is hopefully I can get in close, be fast, and drop a bomb. Not too close and fast because I don't I wanted to give time to arm. And large targets like this were my my main thought for bombers. Okay. Let's see if I can get any damage at all on this. But we're still doing a good job keeping it at... At, uh... Oh! It turned. And it's still doing a good job keeping it at 20% shield, so they're doing a ton of damage. The little fighters are. How's everybody doing? Blue one is basically gone. But the others... Others seem to be doing good. Now, it looks like the trick with this is going to have to be learning how... Uh, learning the enemy's movements and trying to uh, keep up with them. So, well, the bomb, anyway. Haha, I'm shooting, too. I can help. Oh, they put a shoot. Probably should have put the jump drive on my hot bar, but uh, jump drive isn't really necessary for a bomber. Well, not this bomber that's intended to be with a capital ship. Is that going to be enough to... It's going to be enough to miss. Yeah, bombs are not going to be my forte. It's going to be against stations. I think the bombs are going to be most effective for me personally. Also, lag does not uh, does not help. Although I am looking at a new uh, 
a graphics card. I've been saving up for one, so hopefully I'll be able to do bigger projects once once I get my hands on one. And some new memory. I'd like some new memory as well. Not that I have bad memory, so... <laughs> Let's see if I can if I can try to match it. It's going about that fast and well if I do something like that. Ah missed. Good grief. Again, my fighters are still alive. Mostly. Well, this one would be very dead. My fighters are still very much alive. They move too fast for the battleship to really lock in on them. And uh, they're keeping shields down, which is more than I would have expected than most things. Huh. I got hit by something and took my shields down. But I don't count anymore because I'm in god mode. But that's mostly to test the viability of bombing in battle than actual anything else. Uh, aiming a little low because uh, the rotten thing stopped. Connect, connect, connect! Come on! It's not going to connect. What's overheating? Uh, ghost. Oh, okay, that was my camera ship. That I abandoned. Oh, 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 there were blocks, blocks. I saw blocks. Did I actually wing something? Blocks are flying off this vessel. Oh, they're getting through. They are actually got through. They shouldn't have, but they actually did. Okay. See, maybe if I come down from, like, this angle, it'll do better. The grief bombs take forever to reload. And my bomb missed because I was doing it funky angles and whatnot. Yeah, I'm not a good... I'm not a good pilot to start out with. So, for me, bombing is not something I'm going to be doing. Except for to a station. But, yeah, this this um, this squadron I have, uh, looks like blue 3 got hit, and green 2 is... Who knows what happened to green 2. But the other fighters, looks like they're fast enough to avoid the, the main barrage. And enough to keep it occupied. Is if I was in another ship, probably even equal to this battleship, having its shields kept at twenty percent, that would be amazing. And boom. And it overshot. So yes, I think this fleet is is uh, great against larger ships, which is what I would want it for, running interference and whatnot, and they aren't tremendously expensive. But I am shooting something with this bomb. It's going to be this Pirate Station Alpha. Eee! I can't even tell where I am. Ah, yeah, that's the windowy part right there. Action module somewhere in that region. If the laser light show would end, let's get a good running start. And adjust my trajectory. Contact. 
I don't know. Let's see if we make contact. I don't see a bomb trail coming out the other end, so I'm guessing it hit something. Will you stop shooting me like that? Yep, it made contact. And boy, did it. Let's see, I can hit something that isn't moving. <laughs> Alright, well, overall, I'm happy. I am pleased. Uh, W6 lead. False. There we go. That should be hurting me now. Yep. Chewing away at the at the ship. Anyway, I'm overall very pleased with the uh, with the bombers and the fighters and all that good stuff. I think you did a great job. They fit in the hangars. Now I just need to fit them in the hangar for the dreadnought. Finish the dreadnought, and I want one more support ship because this makes nine bays. It's one utility ship, two bombers, six fighters. Six. That makes nine ships altogether, and I have ten. Uh, and the cutter because I have ten altogether hangers. So one more. I'm thinking a shuttle or something along those lines. But we will do that next time. I have been JW608. This has been Star Made. I'll dig you cats later.